Hey YouTube, and today I'm going to be doing a minifigure review. Um, sorry I haven't made a video in a while. I, well, I was busy at school, but I, school is ending next week, so hopefully I'll be able to put up a few more videos than usual. <clears throat> anyway, I want to show you these minifigures. First with Red Robin. Um, this is the new 52 version of Red Robin, custom, um, made by, well, pr the printed designs were made by Online Salen, um, eBay seller, makes awesome custom minifigures, do check out his thingy, <clears throat> uh, yeah, and... But the the wings were made by me. They they took a while to make. Basically, I took a dark red cape, and uh, I I sharpied it and cut it and sewed that there so that it stayed together more. Cause that's oh, that's kind of hard to see, but there isn't much there. But anyway, you can s barely see that he has. The, the printing looks very, like, three-dimensional on it. Like, you can't really see it because my camera is a piece of crap. But, um, you can tell it's, like, three-dimensional, just like the way it shines. Um, the utility belt is, rather than just being on the torso, like Lego does it, it's, like, between the torso and legs where the belt would go on a normal person. <clears throat> very nice has some cool little knee pads and you you can see his shoes and right there and there's 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 more um like little pouches and capsules for stuff and um there's a symbol it's, well technically that's just like this black shiny thing I guess but that that's a symbol that he had on his old suit before the new fifty new fifty two reboot, and I don't know what that is. The back printing, uh, it's pretty simple. Like it's it's just really just what you see there is there, but um, it also has the continuation of the belt pouch style this time, and also the red bits that were on the front right there. And then and, and, and like I ha I've had this guy for a few months. I just forgot that I hadn't done a review on him, so yeah. Just I don't know. Oh, and then also Scarecrow. I I ordered this guy five days ago, six days I don't know, something like that. And um he's He's also made by online Salen, and I and I haven't taken him out of the bag yet, as you can see. So let's do that. Wow. He makes such good minifigures. Oh yeah, I, I forgot to mention that this version of Scarecrow is from Batman: Arkham Asylum. The it's it's a video game. So if you're unfamiliar with that game, you probably won't know what this figure is supposed to look like. But he looks really kind of scary, actually. Um, just as a first impression. So you can tell that obviously he really isn't wearing a full shirt. Only thing in the design of this character, um, that, I, I didn't really like how Rocksteady pulled that off, where they didn't, oh, oh, <laughs> I might have made a pun there, but, yeah, like, his minifigures are really textured, and they, you, they feel really cool, and, um, has kind of like a loincloth thing right there going on with stitches and locks and bandaged bare feet 
for some reason. I'm not sure what I think about the toes, because LEGO has done unprinted toes and printed toes in the past. So, I don't know, either way is fine, I guess. A um, little bit of muscle detail there you can barely see. More stitches, more locks, more of the same. Um, hood, I'll, I'll show you a face later. More stitches, more locks, more skin detail. Um, and then, like, you you see these, like, little, little, um, things, I guess. And they, they seem to have something to do with the Wolverine claws here. And that, that's, um, this is supposed to represent his fear, fear gauntlet thing, where, um, basically it's supposed to simulate him having, like, these, these, um, syringes f filled with fear toxin on his on the ends of his fingers and it, it it's pretty it's pretty scary pretty scary um so that's what that is again more stitches and weird and skin detail and a weird like tunic shirt thing um loincloth is con st kind of thing is continued back here and there's some there's still more stitches I don't know what those lines are though right there I don't know what those are anyway I'm gonna take off the hood to show you what that's his face um the mouth is stitched but you can still tell he's frowning um nice and scary would have preferred if he had um left the eyes just like blank and, and black but not, not, I guess that's okay too you, ha you see like the gas 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 mask um kind of things on his cheeks and, and uh, wow wow his minifigures are a bit stiff like when you first get them and, yeah, there's, there's some stitches there. I'm not sure why he put those there, because they're just going to be covered up by the hood. But, you know, that just makes this figure that much better, because he, he went above and beyond with this. And so, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please slap that like button for some more videos. I guess I'll still make videos, even if you don't, so... I guess it doesn't real, really matter. Also, if you like the commentary, please subscribe. And yeah, that's that's going to be about it for this video. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.